Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Members, I'm going to tell you before I get started, I'm going to withdraw this amendment. Um, and one of my colleagues, uh, I appreciate them pointing out something I had considered. It was one of those things that seemed like a good idea at the moment. And I do think it is an excellent idea for school districts to consider um, a reunification process and, and uh, implement following a mass shooting. We saw in Uvalde the, the whole process for matching up the parents with their kids from the school was something, of course, they never anticipated having to do, and it, it created even more trauma than was already going on and uh, a lot of unnecessary grief and misery. And so I do think it's an excellent idea for a school district to do that. My problem is, is if I put it in this bill, in this place where I was going to put it, it's going to be a, almost like a fire drill that the children are required to do. Uh, you know, what do you do in the event of a mass shooting? And I just think that's pretty traumatic on second and third graders. And uh, I think it's a great thing for the school district to do. So while I think it's a good idea, I'm not sure that this bill in this spot is the right place to do it for that reason. So with that, with your permission, I'd like to withdraw this amendment. The amendment is withdrawn.